And so our next game on the card is Mist of Noya. And Mist of Noya is an early access game that's currently going for $19.99 USD. It is available on Steam. Um, I do want to take the time to thank the developer and publishers of Mist of Noya for providing me with a free copy of the game to play on tonight's stream. Now, the reason why I'm not going to be starting a new game is because it doesn't really tell you much. And I'm at an area where it's pretty exciting because it starts off kind of slow. But you do get to choose from those five characters. Um, as Dan would say, I chose the Hell's Bendel with the silver hair. <laughs> and I am a level five. But you get to choose from Lance, Allure, I'm playing as Allure, Nin, Rise, and Violet. But I'm playing as Allure. Is it make it? Wait a minute. It was making me play the game, make start a new game. But where I'm at right now is pretty exciting, so I'd rather just play from there. But you do a lot of farming in this game. It seems to be more farming than um, anything else. It looks like they update. Yeah, they upgraded it or updated it since I last played. That's the seller. Getting rid of some of my old gear. Okay, let's go. Back this way. And that's how we chop wood. Or in this case, we're chopping ice now. Because though they they definitely upgraded this since I last played. Oh, get out of here. They are level 22s. Or no, they were level 12s. I should have been able to handle that. Let me see. Okay, let's see what's up here. There's wood. We should be able to fish. And then because I got under the water, I fell. All right. So for sure, they have definitely, without a doubt, upgraded. Or updated the game since I, uh... Yeah, I'm a level five. It doesn't take long to level up in this. But this is a multiplayer game as well.
It just takes forever to level up. They definitely made the creatures a lot harder in this. Let me see if I can actually... Because when I first played this, this didn't have a lot of... Um... Those look like those are supposed to all be... Let me see. Maybe if I go back this way. Because I think when I first ran through here, there were no merchants. And now there's a ton of merchants. Yeah, it does. I tend to like games that have a lot of pixel art in it as well. I love pixel art. A lot of people are like, they're tired of it. But I actually really, really... Enjoy pixel art. In fact, a lot of the games that you'll see me play tend to be pixel art based games. Let's see what's going on. Can't construct anything there. <laughs> I'm tired of BR games, but we can all, we cannot get our way. That is true. And yeah, I heard, you know, like I said, the last thing I heard with Fortnite, they took the building mode out, and I heard that they went back and added save the world but I think they kind of made people so angry that it's like too late now like I am dying way too quick like and I can't find a place where I can farm to get my level higher Yeah, no, I don't even know what level you were. And then this too, it's an art, it's a roguelike, so it does change. Like if you notice this time around, the characters are a lot stronger. So it is a road light. Almost a level, uh... That's right, he can jump across. Might as well cut down nice trees. Alright, we got talent points. Um... Like, it never lets me open that up. And then this is your perks. That was dirty. I was in my menu and it killed me. That's what you call dirty. <laughs> yeah, that's what you call dirty.
Heavy leather. Cause we're gonna need that. Cut down this tree. Go here. So things I can say they have improved on since I last played. Um, they added merchants, which weren't were not there when I first played this. Um, you dirty dog! Literally, you dirty dog! Nice. Now, yes, you can swim under there. There's nothing up there. Let's go through here and see what's in here. Dirty mammoth. Okay. Mammoth played me. We'll probably get ready to wrap this one up too. You can fish. So we need ten trouts. Might as well see if we can get our fish from here at least. But yeah, so that's pretty much, or this is pretty much Mist of Noya in a nutshell. Pretty much farm and kill things, that's all you're pretty much doing, and I probably could 
do some crafting, but that's a fishing rod. And I don't have any other blueprints yet, so. Alrighty, let's go ahead and wrap this one up. But that is Mist of Noya. And again, this is an early access game and it is available on Steam for PC and it is going for $19.99 USD. Um, you can't play multiplayer in this, but overall it's just a farming game where you're fighting things and farming. That's pretty much the gist of it. Um, if you like what you saw of the game, you can go ahead and click or use exclamation point GOTW or simply click on the link here that will pop up and that's going to take you to a Google Doc of all the games that I am playing tonight, where you can find those games, the price of the games, as well as the platforms for the games. Now, even if you cannot purchase a game, I cannot stress this enough, please go ahead and wishlist the game. Wishlisting the games does help out the developers a lot. It allows for their games to be seen on if they get enough wishlists, because it helps with the algorithm for Steam. And if they get enough wishlists, they can end up on the front page of Steam or even the new and trendworthy section of Steam. So when in doubt, please, please wish list it out. And again, a very big thank you to the developers and publishers of Mist of Noya for providing me with a free copy of the game to play on tonight's stream.